Okay, Gemini, welcome back to my channel and you viewers are always welcome. So I'm going to start your reading with tarot cards and then I'll finish it off with just random messages, what they want to tell you guys. Uh, keep in mind that the roles can be reversed. Cross watchers are always welcome and take what resonates and leave the rest. So this is your reading for August 2022. So I'm just going to jump in. I pre-shuffled. We'll see what they got for you guys. Tell me about Gemini, please. Thank you. Okay, so this full card is coming out a lot in my readings. So some kind of new start here. Just give me a second. Wow, wow, wow. What's going on? We've got three queens here. Queen of Cups, Queen of Swords, Queen of Wands. Give me a second. Wow. So I know there's no gender in tarot, but it seems like there was a female involved here. More than one, it seems like. It was a one-sided relationship for you guys. Someone could have been really greedy, overspending, very um, standoffish, bitter, deceitful, pessimistic, manipulating with the Queen of Swords. This person uh, could have left you without any closure. Okay, and now you're on your own they are greedy it seems like thank you so this person could have been really selfish a demanding lover very dominant could have fought a lot with you very vengeful jealous selfish so wow so this ace of pentacles i feel like it's talk talking in a reverse meaning um so yeah, this because excuse me, this person could have been really stingy. This one I'm getting from this card, just really, really stingy. Uh, it caused a lot of money issues for you. Tell me more for Gemini. Oof, what is this? I've never seen a reading like this where there's three queens involved. They could have had you in a third party, Gemini. That's what it's looking like. This person could have been really childish, but I feel like the full card is you starting off fresh. Tell me more for Gemini. Thank you. Okay, so this, obviously this thing failed. Uh, I feel like you guys tried to plan a lot of things, but it didn't go out the way you wanted it to. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. So this person, okay, sorry. This person could have been a Capricorn, like had a lot of like drug issues. They could have cheated on you a lot is what I'm getting from this. Yeah, they disregarded your feelings, Gemini. But I feel like the main thing about this card is that they cheated on you, okay? More so than anything else. For most of you Geminis, this person cheated on you and you felt trapped at one point. So you grieved this breakup. You were sad, obviously, with the Five of Cups. You moved on from it. Oof. This person could have wanted your forgiveness. This person really made you feel like insecure, okay? They made you feel like shit. <laughs> like that's what I'm getting from this card, okay? This could also be you being confident now, drawing in new people, but I feel like this is more so talking about the past. So again, okay, they left with no closure. This reading is like ridiculously deceptive, okay? We've got the devil card. We've got three queens here that seemed... It seemed like there's like three people fighting in this um, and a lot of hidden secrets, okay? Very deceitful energy. This person could have had you in fear or you got clarity about what was happening. There's a lot of sabotage uh, going on behind your back. You were uncertain about this person, okay? Uh, they wanted, I feel like at one point you did reconcile with this person, but it didn't work out and I feel like you also like you feel haunted by this person like you can't you can't let go 
So yeah, this person was really clingy, really jealous, insecure. They tried to hold on to as much money as they could. They were really stingy, okay? Like it doesn't get stingier than this with the Four of Pentacles. This is the stingy person card. They try to conserve a lot of money and not share it with anybody else. But they were really possessive over you at the same time. And I feel like you were suffocated at one point. Like this person was really overbearing. You couldn't get away from this person because they were so controlling. They tried to control every aspect of your uh, finances. This could have been anybody, a friend, a girlfriend, a wife, like anybody. But I feel like mainly for you guys, it's somebody that you were dating. Okay. That, like, I feel drained, okay? Just, like, I'm, I'm getting hit by this drained <laughs> energy right now, and I feel like it's coming from that reading. That's crazy, yo. This person was the devil, okay? Let me tell y'all. This person was, like, like, they knew how to pull on your strings like type of person okay wow y'all <laughs> you're dealing with someone crazy okay health can't let you go someone here is trustworthy Someone is creeping and it seems like it's this uh, ex of yours. It could have been an Aquarius or this is a new person spying on you. Okay, what did I tell y'all? So their family members could have been involved too. Okay, like complete nightmare for you. Heal. Someone here is wanting this with you. Okay, so you did have the devil card. Imagining kids with you and a Capricorn. So heavy, heavy Capricorn in this reading. Heavy, heavy air energy in this reading. So one person seems like they're very um, stable and like loyal. They want kids with you. But I feel like this Capricorn, for most of you Geminis, you were dealing with a Capricorn. Okay? It could be any sign, I'm just saying. But some of y'all are dealing with a Capricorn for sure. Okay, so I feel like they want you to cleanse your energy. and work on your work, whatever you're doing, okay? So Gemini, I think I'm gonna stop there because I'm like, I don't wanna invite no fucking demon, excuse my language, no demon in my room right now with all this negative energy. <laughs> I'm kidding. Okay, so yeah, that's your reading for August and I will see y'all for your next reading. Take care.